Back again with another trailer reaction. My name is Josh. Thanks for checking out the channel. And if you click the thumbnail, you're probably here to see some Lockwood and Co. So I don't know very much about this. I did react to a teaser trailer that came out a few months, month and a half back, something of that nature, where I had absolutely no idea and then saw a little teaser, clearly in a teaser trailer, but I didn't know much about it, didn't give too much away, but then a lot of viewers did actually let me know a little bit more that it is a book series, that it's uh, about supernatural kind of, I don't know if it's like mystery solving or crime fighting. I can't remember which one. It's been a little while, but there were some very helpful viewers in there. So let's go at that. And they were very adamant about the, the book series and hopeful that this was going to be a really good series. So that's really what drove me back to go ahead and see how the trailer is. So without further ado, let's get to this. It's terrible the world's come to this. I feel sorry for your generation. Agents required for unusual supernatural investigation. Name? Lucy Carlyle. I'm Anthony Lockwood. This is George. Welcome to Lockwood & Co. How about we find ourselves a ghost? Don't move. Run! I don't enjoy meeting agents who burn homes to the ground. Pay up or get shut down. London will be a lot safer with three less amateurs stumbling around. The big agencies pretend they've got things under control. So, what now? All it takes is a few big cases. Solve this. We'll be the most famous agents in the country. <laughs> with maniacs. You're caught in the cogs, slaves to a system. We're dealing with real life criminals. I'd like to start running now. Every girl from London is up to kill us. Power cannot stay buried. Now we're gonna die. There are ghosts. And then there's us, and it is kill or be killed. Death is coming. We're Lockwood and Co. You, me, and George. Alright, so that comes out later this month. That actually, it looked pretty solid. There were, at first I was a little concerned because they're, like the main actors or actresses, they seem pretty young, like they're maybe going for a pretty, you know, young demographic, which is not exactly the way that I'm trending at the moment. But then it definitely got a little more involved with a uh, bigger scale than I thought it was going to be, I kind of what I'm trying to say. So it definitely looked like there was a really cool world that's created there as far as with the paranormal. I'm not sure if there's a bunch of agencies that are doing it or if he's just talking about different law enforcement agencies that don't know what's happening. Or is it a world where there's, you know, maybe it's more well known that there are ghosts or at least there's a bunch of companies that deal with that. So that could be really neat and definitely looked like it had a lot of good action. It looked like it'd be a show that I would really maybe I would have enjoyed when I was a little bit younger. Not going to say that it's not going to be a good show, and I definitely will give it a shot, and I dig the the vibe of it being in England. The music choice was spot on, so that was good. I don't know. Let me know in the comment section. Is it more for a certain demographic as far as age-wise, or can it be enjoyed for everybody? I love ghost things. I mean, there's little hints of Ghostbusters in there as well. I'm just concerned it's a little towards the kitty side, but it might not be. I don't know. Let me know in the comment section. Don't forget, like, share, subscribe. Go hit that subscribe button if you would. That'd be fantastic. And as always, you're awesome. Peace out.